Welcome to another edition of Yes, We're Here. I'm with John, the owner of Aladoro. And John, you've been doing some awesome things during this COVID-19 outbreak in the city. Will you just tell us what you've been up to at Aladoro? We've been doing a lot of philanthropic stuff. So there was obviously an initial real panic and doom and gloom moment for really all of us in this industry. Um, but we, we, it sort of pivoted into this opportunity to help. We started doing uh, direct donations to hospital workers who are sort of, you know, the, on the front lines. These guys are unreal. Um, and we partnered with, with several hospitals. Um, and so we're doing direct donations. Um, we're also doing olive oil. So we partnered with World Central Kitchen, uh, uh, Jose, Chef Jose Andres' foundation that's amazing. Uh, it feeds people around the world. So proceeds from our olive oil sales are going to them. You mentioned that you came up with the idea and decided to, you know, take lemons and make lemonade and find a way to help people in, in your community. Can you just take me through the process? How does it all go down? Somebody makes a donation and then what happens on your end? Yeah, so, uh, well, for the, for the direct donations, uh, we've set up on our website a portal. So it's, we've tried to make it as easy as possible. So basically, you just, you know, you go to our website. We have a landing. We have a splash page there now that, you know, can direct you immediately to the donation page. And we're selling lunch boxes. So it's basically a package of you can feed five people for $50, um, and you can buy however many of those packages as you want. And so, you know, in the beginning, it was obviously just sort of like, you know, getting friends and family to kind of participate. And it's really started to blow up. I mean, we did over 200 orders, 200 boxes just in the past couple hours. So it's really exploded. And, and you know, look, it's just that that's the great thing about what's going If there is a great thing about what's going on right now, it's just the sense of community that's happening and togetherness that's, that's come from all this. And I mean, you know, people are... You know, from all walks of life, we're getting donations from all, from, from cu existing customers, you got anybody, and we're seeing a lot come in. John, they're getting them together behind you. What exactly is going into every box? Well, it's sort of like the, you know, the, the, the standard favorite order, which is, uh, you know, one of our signature sandwiches, uh, a bag of chips, and a chocolate chip cookie, and a, and a little personal note from us, thanking, thanking the workers for everything they're doing. What's been the reaction when you show up to these hospitals with these meals? Pulling up to the hospital, and I'll give you an example, like today, NYU Langone is one of our partners. It's a huge hospital. And, you know, it's one thing to see the photos and videos and talk to people on the phone about what we're doing and sort of coordinating. A lot of it's that. But, yes, pulling up and seeing the line around the hospital, literally. I mean, we're talking about a line around the whole hospital. Uh, to see their faces when we pull up is something I didn't really expect. It took me by surprise how sort of emotional it was. And, you know, it, it is an emotional thing. And it's certainly not, it's not about me. It's about them. And I made sure that they knew that when we got there. And we have, you know, we try to make sure they know that I'm, I don't need any, you know, gratitude. I'm, we're thankful to them. So it's really all about them right now. Hey, have you been taken aback by the community support and what you've seen and people reaching out to you and people donating? Uh, it, it's, it's, it, it's astounding. I mean, I, I, like I said in the beginning, it was just like, hey, mom, like, can you, <laughs> can you ask your friends to donate? Uh, and she did. Thank you, mom. Uh, uh, you know, and other family members as well. It was, you know, it's amazing. But now, you know, we've, we've really had an influx and people are, are hearing about it. And we're getting people from all around that are calling and going online to place orders and you know, we're partnered with a with a um, an organization called Off Their Plate. I won't I won't go through the whole detail of it, but it's another amazing organization uh, that's taking in donations and and funding uh, uh, meals to medical workers. Are you looking forward to hopefully an even bigger demand to filling those orders and getting more food out there to the people yeah. on the front lines? Yeah, I mean, the more the merrier. And look, and not to be certainly this this was obviously born out of uh, helping the community and, and helping the, the, the virus that's going on and all these, these, these medical worker heroes out there. But, you know, look, the restaurant, it's no lie, the restaurant business is really struggling. You know, restaurants employ 15 and a half million people. Uh, it's a big deal. 
you know, they contribute like almost about a trillion dollars to the U.S. economy. So the fact that I've had to lay off most of my staff, you know, that's a very big deal. So the more food we're producing, the more people I can hire back. So, you know, that's part of it, too. So it definitely is a two pronged effect. John, you're known for the great sandwiches that you guys make, but did you ever think that you'd be providing love and care in a sense in this type of way from sandwiches? Well, as we all know, you know, food is love and, you know, not to sound cheesy, but it really is. I mean, everybody, you know, obviously some of our, our I'm certainly mine and I'm sure others fondest memories are at a rest, their favorite restaurant, neighborhood restaurant or around their dinner table. So food is always something that's brought people together. And, you know, Aladoro is, it's kind of a special treat thing. It's a, you know, it's, it's all really authentic Italian sandwiches and the ingredients that are in them. And so, yeah, it, it obviously, it kind of goes hand in hand with making sure people have, if, if we can improve these medical workers' days at all, uh, then, uh, you know, my work is done. So we're really happy to be part of it uh, and, and help people get, you know, make their day a little bit better. Well, we thank you for all the work you're doing. We know everybody appreciates it. Again, it's Aladoro. You can go to their website and make a donation if you want to. It would be greatly appreciated. John, thanks for the time. Thank you, Meredith. Go Yankees. <laughs>